Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. What happens in a defamation case? Defamation cases arise when a false statement harms an individual's reputation. The plaintiff must prove several key elements. First, the statement must be defamatory, meaning it negatively impacts the person's reputation. Second, the statement must be false. Truth is a complete defense against defamation claims. Third, the plaintiff must show that the statement was published. This means it was communicated to someone other than the person being defamed. Fourth, the plaintiff must demonstrate fault. In cases involving public figures, the standard is higher, requiring proof of actual malice. For private individuals, negligence may suffice. Next, the plaintiff must show actual harm or damages. This can include loss of income, emotional distress, or damage to reputation. In some cases, defamation per se applies, where harm is presumed due to the nature of the statement. Once filed, the case may proceed through discovery where both parties gather evidence. If the case does not settle, it will go to trial. A judge or jury will determine whether defamation occurred and the appropriate damages. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning into our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.